everybody, it is me, Double Pickaxe. I am back today with Cyberpunk 2077. I'm gonna be playing it. I'm gonna see if it's good or if it's bad. Because I heard a lot of people saying, oh, this game is bad. And then other people say, oh, this game is good. This game is very controversial, so. Like on Steam, it has 7 out of 10. So I'm gonna do a definitive review, because this is my first time ever playing Cyberpunk 2077. I'm playing it on my PS5. So there are three different street paths. If I'm gonna be real, I think I'm doing the Carpo one. So now we can pick our body type. We can change okay. our character. IRL, I have a mustache, but I don't have a beard. These all look, these all look, these all look incredibly metal. Like, oh my goodness. These look like the most human teeth. Excuse me, but I don't want to, I don't have, I don't want to have, uh, scary, all pointy robot teeth. Now we're finally in the loading screen to get to Cyberpunk. Finally, I agree, this game looks pretty good. Like, some people have said it's bad, others have said it good. I don't know. We're gonna see. What did I just do? Did I just spit? Me. You there? And we jump by pressing X. Okay. Please, I just, I just want to get to the, I just want to get to the game, please. Bro, what just happened? So this game be like, I mean, people who play this game be like, so many bugs! Yet I haven't, I literally haven't encountered a single bug. Yeah, this, this is, this is mega brain time. This game is so dark, like, where's a way to, where's a way to change the brightness? Find a spot close to the bar, as close as you can. Mm. Fuck procedures. Initiating landing sequence based on new parameters. Oh my goodness, okay, let's get started! Okay, let's go, we got a weapon. We got a cool gun. Oh my goodness, no cap, this a lot, the graphics are very good. Like, honestly, what I think of this game right now is it's literally just a futuristic GTA with a lot better graphics, like, no cap. These graphics, graphics are very good, like, a lot of these. This graphic, these graphics look almost realistic. Oh my goodness, it literally shows us how much damage we did. Which is the which is that button? Oh, it's up. I wonder how many bullets do we have? Oh my goodness! Please stop with the recoil, dude. This game, we have to learn how to hack. This training module will teach you how to apply technological tools to combat situations. Work a little half magic on the screen. Oh, come on. Like, you can literally kill a guy and hide his body in the dumpster. You can't do that in Minecraft. Goodness, you can't even do that in, in GTA either. This game just straight up told me to edit his code. Bro, I literally just finished a tutorial. Stealth. <sighs> I don't really like stealth. I agree that sometimes it's useful. This is like a lot of like that part from Ocarina of Time. 
where you have to dodge the guards to get to Zelda. I don't know how I just survived that. What? Yes. No, 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 no. You know what? Oh, come on. I was just fighting him. Okay, come on. This guy doesn't stand a chance. Let's be real. Come on, buddy, go back to training, please. Oh, so now I have a... Now I can charge, I can Mega Man. Oof. Oh my goodness, this does more than the bullets. Wow, this guy's got to be strong. We also heal, we also heal, like, Wolverine. Which is pretty cool. You know what, I'm gonna tire this guy out. Oh my goodness, why is this guy... What? Come on, this guy's so strong. There. Locked his attacks. I finally found out... How to do this part. Like, how to do the dodge training the attacks. You have to set the difficulty level to the highest mode. Or else... Or else it won't, or else the character won't attack at the right time. Scarred sword time. Whoosh, whoosh. Jump slash. Oh my goodness, dude, dude. You know that it, yeah, you can literally make, you can literally make robots kill themselves. Fear, I may have found that out a little bit too late. Okay, oh yeah, so I think that is pretty much... The end of the tutorials. I personally believe that Cyberpunk runs best on PlayStation 5. If you have a PS4, honestly, don't bother getting this game for PlayStation. Just get it for computer, but if you if you have a PlayStation 5, then you can get it. Yeah, this game runs great on PlayStation 5. I literally just had a gun, I don't... What did I just... What was that? Bro, I don't know where to hide. I don't have a gun, and I have literally no place to hide. No! No, 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 no. I didn't know that they were going to be there. No, 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 no. Okay, yeah, I'm dead. Come th That was a headshot, bro. Come on, I shot that guy in the head like thrice. How did he die each time? How there, how there was one death and like three headshots. Is this a is this is this a firearm at all? Either this either this is either this is bought a toy or the bullets are cheap. There we go. All right, I got him. Oh my goodness. Okay, he's a lot closer than we expect. So much. Oh my goodness. Look at this. This place looks pretty cool, actually. No cap, this place looks pretty cool. Look at that Naranjita drink. Oh my goodness, I wonder what that tastes like. I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'll be alive come 2077. Yeah, everyone, I'm sorry I couldn't show that. It's just, if I showed the, if I showed the part of the game, that I just played, I would get in trouble by YouTube. Wait, what? Oh my goodness, this is a lot like that Majora's Mask minigame where you have to shoot the Ango brothers so they don't take the milk. So oh my goodness, I shot that guy so many times. the end of this review. Now I'm going to give the score.